Hi everyone! In the modern world, we are surrounded by all sorts of logos. So often we don't even think about how elaborate and complex they are. Tasty toaster tarts? Awesome! Creating a logo is not a simple thing. It must be original, memorable, and concise. Even the simplest trademark logo, consisting of only three and a half letters, takes many hours of work. The marketing specialists discuss every dash, every stroke, check the slant down to the millimeter, try hundreds of combinations of different colors and shades. Some companies, however, have gone even further. They come up with fantastic ideas and sometimes there's a whole story behind their creation. Today, we will unravel the secrets behind the logos of the world's most recognized companies. Let's get it on! Vio. If you are a fan of laptops or just a tech-savvy person, then you will definitely recognize this brand. Vio is a laptop, and you have probably wondered why its logo looks so weird. The letters are wide, large, and have no sharp edges. And to be honest, it's kind of hard to think of it as a valid word. What is that? Turns out the logo was made like this for a purpose. The first letters are not a fancy of the designer, but a hidden digital signal. To be precise, an analog signal. The sine waves like this can be seen on the oscilloscope display. The last two letters are another reference to data transmission, which carries out digital signals corresponding to, yes, you guessed right, the numbers 1 and 0. Apple There are many myths and speculations around the logo of this brand, which dominates the world of smartphones. For a long time, there were rumors that the bitten apple was a tribute to the Englishman Alan Turing. This scientist made a huge contribution to the development of computer science and laid a solid foundation for the era of modern computers. Turing allegedly died after biting into an apple laced with poison. This half-eaten fruit was found on his bedside table. The theory might seem fascinating, but it's not true. The artist who drew the logo refuted it, saying it had nothing to do with Turing. Another popular theory says that the apple, as a symbol of knowledge, is a reference to the biblical story of Adam and Eve. The third one says that the fruit is a tribute to Isaac Newton, who was inspired by the falling apple to discover the concept of gravity. These theories are quite interesting. They also give the company a spiritual image, however. The real story is much more prosaic. The company was founded in 1976. The artist did not receive any specific instructions on the logo from Steve Jobs, so he decided to keep things simple and drew an apple. The Bite is not at all a reference to bites, as many believe. When the logo was reduced, the fruit stopped looking like an apple and resembled a cherry or tomato. Well, the bite helped fix the situation. Paramount Pictures Paramount Pictures is another company that has a bunch of myths associated with its logo. The company was founded in 1912 and changed its legendary logo several times over more than a hundred years of its existence. The style and colors changed, but two elements remained the same, the mountain and the stars. According to various theories, the mountain can be based on Mount Ben Lamond in Utah, Artist San Raju in Peru, or Mount Visso in Italy. However, none of them are correct. Paramount Pictures was founded by three men. At one of the meetings, one of them drew a mountain while being deep in thought. Legend has it that he saw a similar mountain in his childhood when he visited Utah with his family. Everyone liked the drawing so much that they made a logo out of it. As for the stars, there are 22 of them in the logo. Those stars represent the first 22 actors who were contracted with the studio during the old days. The original plan was to add a new star onto the emblem every time a new actor joined the team. However, the movie industry was developing so fast that Paramount Pictures had to give up on the idea. Levi's these stories are quite complicated and somehow confusing, don't you think? So let's talk about brands whose logo history is simpler, shorter, and does not cause so much debate, like Levi's. The American company specializes in the production of clothing. This brand is recognized all over the world for its jeans aesthetics, though today it sells literally anything from caps to sneakers and t-shirts. But what about the logo, you might ask? Over 167 years of company history, it has changed more than once. The shape of the last one is a reference to the jeans, or rather to the signature pattern on the back pockets. Just take a close closer look and you will see that their upper part is very much like a trademark image from a logo. Adidas 
If you've ever seen ads for sportswear, and you probably have, then you know what's the main message there. Don't be lazy, get better, faster, higher, stronger, just do it, you can do it, and so on. Ding, ding, boom, boom, elbow, elbow, boom, liver shot, bang, bang. If you keep this in mind and look at the logo of the Adidas sportswear brand for a long time, then suddenly the stripes of different colors start to make sense. And of course, their design had a message. The brand's logo was created to symbolize something like a mountain. Well, these stripes are obstacles that you have to overcome to achieve your goal. Just like in life, each new column is higher than the previous one. Google We already mentioned that creating even a minimal set of letters in a logo always takes a lot of effort, and we meant it. Take a look at all the logo options designed for Google before the search engine finally entered the market. There are about 10 options, and this might be only a small fraction that has leaked onto the internet. The big letter at the beginning was chosen to make the logo look more respectable. The variety of colors adds some playfulness, but the colors are not arranged in the rainbow color. This is a deliberate choice to add some randomness. The colors are supposed to be arranged in a certain order. Blue, red, yellow. So after the blue letter G, there should be a red letter, but instead, there's a green one. This was the company's way to show that Google is not like all other companies, because it does not follow the rules. Such a complex, thoughtful logo made with only six letters of different colors. Amazon. Now let's talk about the world's largest e-commerce platform. Really cool. You've got mail. When you go to the Amazon website, it may seem that you can find any product here and, you may have never noticed this, but the site logo seems to hint at it. The smiling arrow is a warm inviting gesture that adds more confidence to the logo, but it also implies that you can find all the things you need on Amazon, from A to Z. Toblerone Let's play a little game. Close your eyes and think about the packaging of the Toblerone chocolate bar. Got it? Now tell us what is depicted on it besides letters. Reply in the comments down below. We bet that 90% of you wrote a mountain, and that's right, but only in part. There's actually something else hidden in the logo. Let us give you a hint. The company was established in 1908 in the Swiss city of Bern. A bear is featured on the coat of arms of the town. Now look at the Toblerone mountain again. Do you see it yet? Yes, a bear is hiding in the logo as a tribute to the homeland of the beloved treat. Absolutely right! <laughs> By the way, the mountain on the logo is not an imaginary one, but quite real. It's called the Matterhorn Mountain. Baskin Robbins The logo of the next brand is a visual puzzle. As soon as you find the hidden symbols, you can no longer unsee them. Welcome to Baskin Robbins. To decipher the message, we need to get back to the past. Baskin Robbins was founded in 1945, and almost from the very beginning, the brand's thing was the huge variety of ice cream flavors it offered, 31 to be precise. To emphasize its huge range of tastes, the brand put the number 31 in its logo. It used to look different, though. In modern times, the market embraced the fashion of simplifying and shortening logos, which Baskin Robbins, of course, followed. However, the company did not want to part with the number 31, so it's hidden in the BR abbreviation. McDonald's. It's time to talk about perhaps the most recognizable logo in the world. This is actually verified official information. As you might have guessed, there's some history behind this logo too. The famous Golden Arch is a reference to the restaurants opened in the 1950s. Richard and Maurice McDonald wanted to create a fundamentally new, memorable design. The architects proposed using two semicircular arches and voila, history was made. The famous letter M was not destroyed even by the upcoming rebranding in the 1960s. All because the design consultant saw a Freudian symbol in the arches, one that affects our consciousness although we're not even aware of it, arches look like breasts, and this, in turn, is unconsciously associated with satiety. The red and yellow colors, by the way, were chosen by psychologists after research showed that such a combination boosts appetite. Dominoes at first glance, the logo of the famous pizza chain does not make any sense at all. However, there is an explanation. The name Domino's is a modified word for Dominic's. This was the name of the chain's very first restaurant, which soon had to be renamed. The three dots symbolized the three working restaurants at the time of the logo's creation in 1965. The idea was to add a new dot each time a new restaurant opens, but you can imagine why the idea didn't work out. Hyundai and here's another brand that followed the fashion for simplifying everything and anything. If you have always wondered what this stylized picture means, then hear us out. This is a legacy of an old logo that looked like two people shaking hands. They symbolize the union of a satisfied customer and a representative of the company. BMW 
For a very long time, it was believed that the logo of the German car manufacturer, BMW, was a stylized aircraft propeller. The idea originally came from a 1929 ad with planes that promoted the brand's aircraft engines. The rumor quickly spread in the media, but a few years ago, BMW decided to finally reveal the truth. It was much less exciting. The brand just wanted to show its origin with the logo, so it chose the colors of the Bavarian flag. Why in this particular order? It is directly opposite to the flag to avoid the legal restrictions that existed at the time of the logo's creation in 1917. Mercedes-Benz since we're talking about car brands, it's impossible not to mention the German Mercedes-Benz, especially since the logo has a history, and quite interesting at that. The three-pointed star symbolizes, you won't believe it, domination on Earth, in the sky, and at sea. The famous star is also closely associated with the family of the company's founders. Gottlieb Daimler's father decorated all the family postcards with the three-pointed star. Toyota Finally, we get to the last logo for today, owned by the famous Japanese corporation Toyota. It is, of course, much more complex than it may seem at first glance. Deep meaning is hidden in the seemingly unremarkable ovals. First of all, they symbolize the merging of the hearts of the customers and the company. And secondly, possibly even more impressive, if you look even closer at the overlapping ovals, you'll see the word Toyota spelled out. <laughs>